Hey friends, thank you so much for watching. Today I'm sharing an Easter Dollar Tree haul and I'm very excited because I asked my friend Natalie Bonet to collab with me. She is a lifestyle and mommy vlogger and I just absolutely adore her. I love her videos, I love her content. She's such an incredible mom and she also vlogs as well. So, oh and also, also, I met her! We met in person in Seattle when um, my family and I, we went to Seattle for Vlogger Fair a couple years ago and we met at Judy's house. Judy had a party and we met there in person. I got to meet her twins and now she has beautiful, she has two sons, they're twins, Liam and Judah, and then she also has a beautiful daughter. I just enjoy watching her videos. She's just so helpful, so, so kind. Just. A wonderful she's mom goals and so I had to reach out to my mom goals mama and let her know like can we collab because I really adore you and she said yes so I'm just so grateful so with that said please watch her video please subscribe to her you guys will love her and let's get started with this haul it's gonna be a long one like I was telling Natalie like I, I'm, I'm gonna share all Easter video it all Easter products and then I want to share non Easter and then I decided I need a dedicated video just for Easter because I ended up going nuts <laughs> so first thing first I got some baskets these are adorable little baskets I actually get um, make Easter baskets for adults like I'm gonna make one for my mother-in-law Susan um so I have these little baskets, I actually have two. One is pink with yellow ribbon and one is lavender with blue. And this is just gonna be so fun. Like I'm gonna put candy snacks in there. And of course, when you have your basket, you gotta, gotta line it up with like the fake grass or the crinkle paper. So I got some of that and I like the colors. Like this is green, blue, and yellow. And what else? I also got some purple ones, maybe to go with a little bit of the pink action. I think that'd be cute. I got the giant Easter eggs. This comes in a six pack. And then I ended up getting the smaller ones in a pack of 10 as well. And then I got some more. This one's the holographic one. I also got these ones. They're carrots and they're see-through. So since they're see-through, it would be so cute to put like jelly beans in there. And for stuffing the Easter basket for my boys, I actually bought the boys an Easter basket from Zulily a couple weeks ago. Uh, I'm still waiting for it to arrive, but it's custom that says their name and it's Jacob's first Easter. So I wanted to do something special. So I got Liam and Jacob the same Easter basket and I can't wait to get it. And when I do get it, I'll share, I'll show you guys in an Instagram story. So definitely follow me there. It's April Athena 7. And then Liam loves to paint. Oh my gosh, and we have so much construction going on right now. Liam just loves watching them do all the things they're doing with the house. Like they painted the floors first before they put the um, the new flooring. And Liam just has been enjoying watching everything. And so wouldn't it be nice if he had his own paint roll? That'd be so fun. And this is made of foam and it's a two-pack. Um, and so I'm putting that in his Easter basket. And then I also got these stamp markers. <laughs> Ever since Liam was really young like I got him into art he would just stamp the heck out of everything and we would we even made a song stamp 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 I still remember the song <laughs> and then wouldn't it be so I actually bought two of these so cute if on the Easter basket you just put this little bunny tail on it it's adorable and you can also put it on you know clothes if you want like on their back ah they're so cute on their pants <laughs> so cute and Oh my gosh, like I was very much impressed with their selection. They actually have like Marvel superheroes and this is a 24 piece um, puzzle. Liam has been really into puzzles and I'm so impressed by like the puzzles he can actually solve. And so I thought 24 piece, he can handle this. So I wanted to get this for him. I, I think he's gonna love it. And he loves superheroes right now. Oh, and then I also got these baskets. I got um, two blue ones and a green one. They look like this. I actually might go back because these baskets are actually really great for putting, I'm party planning Liam and Jacob's first birthday and these are actually great for like placing snacks in it. Um, but yeah, I got these baskets because I'm gonna make a basket for Justin and his dad for Easter and um, I don't like 
do too much with with everyone but i think this is just the perfect size i'm thinking snacks a mug i don't know yet <laughs> if you guys have any ideas for making easter baskets for men please let me know because uh i've never done that i've only made easter easter baskets for little kids like that's it the, actually the first easter basket i've ever made was for liam and i've never made one for my mother-in-law susan actually i did i made them like a joint easter basket um but it was for both of them but this time around i'm doing like individuals so let me know give me ideas uh and then i got two of these guys the reason why i bought two is if i got jakey one liam would want one he's at you know he's at that age you know if my brother has one i want one too even if jakey's eating like a baby cracker liam wants one too <laughs> so i got these two little ducks they're so cute to put in their basket and of course you gotta get the basket bag so i got four of these guys because i think i'm going to be making six easter baskets this year so yeah i had to get the bags and oh my gosh i have to show you guys these are so cute i got one that's a hopping duck little chickadee not a duck chick and then i got a little hopping bunny you just wind it up and then it hops it's so funny this one i already like had jakey chase around the house and he loves it he's just crawling around chasing the little hopping bunny and more marvel superheroes these are stickers and they're easter themed they've got like easter eggs and everything i'm impressed like i can't believe it like marvel and then this a tumbling tower game we actually recently went to the lawrence science museum in berkeley and um there was this room where you could just build these huge towers and there were like thousands of these little blocks so i thought this would be a great idea for liam because it's kind of like taking the little museum home and building things himself at home i'm sure i could have purchased like so much more <laughs> than just this but let's start out with this i love their selection of like school supplies and art supplies they had paint palettes and this is a six piece i'm so impressed because i usually get my paint palettes at hobby lobby and i just buy one for like two bucks but this is a six six piece that's, that's just amazing and i of course i got some easter eggs to put in those little eggies this is chocolate peanut butter. Oh my goodness, I'm so excited. I also got it because I know Justin likes peanut butter. And speaking of peanuts, um, I got some M&Ms, some peanut M&Ms to put in Justin's basket because I think he'll love, um, he'll love it. And it's hard, like I don't know what to put in his basket. Like should I get him like shaving cream? <laughs> Like, what do I put? A mug? Ooh, a San Francisco Giants mug. I think he'd like that. And then, you guys, I every time I go to the Dollar Tree, I feel so, like, excited. Because I sometimes I can't believe the things they sell there. Like, really? A dollar? And this is one of them. Like, they have Star Wars socks, uh, Mickey Mouse socks, Despicable Me socks and Paw Patrol socks, all amazing characters that Liam loves. So I'm really excited about that. I looked for like sizes for Jacob. They didn't really have much. I don't know why. I think Jacob's in like an in-between size. He's not like baby baby since he's 10 months, but he's not like toddler. So it's like, what size? Like they don't have a large selection for him. But I did find him a cute little book, you guys. This is the fruits an educational book so this is like a green apple a red apple i love this book it's just a simple book to just show him different colors and food and he's very much familiar with all the food here he eats them all pretty much so i think he'll like this book and then this i saw and it made me it made me think of you know fingerling the little monkey we have one and it's the cutest thing i think i love it more than my kids to be honest like i love it so much um and this re kind of reminded me of a fingerling puppet in a way. You just put it in your finger and then you just move it around. <gasps> I want to open it. I was about to, but then I was like, no, it's a gift. I can't do that. But <laughs> you just move your hands around with it. And then Liam's been really into paddle balls, so I got him one of those guys. Uh, what else? And then we got some Easter eggs. This is just milk chocolate and that's it. Like there's nothing, no peanuts on this one. So I think that's the one that Liam will probably like. And 
Liam's been really into um, wanting to jump rope. He's like, Mommy, like just randomly one day he said to me, Mommy, can you teach me how to jump rope? And I'm like, sure, let's do it. So I had my own jump rope. I don't know where I got it from. I think I got it from like a, an old FabFitFun box. But the problem is my jump rope is so long that he just had a really hard, even so, though I would like tie it around my wrist and show him like how to jump, he would he would get so frustrated. So I'm sure this is a lot smaller and this is made, you know, for his size. So I'm really excited about that. I'm so excited. So that's it, you guys. Those are all the things that I got at Dollar Tree. I'm so excited for all the Easter goodies. And I did not buy any Easter house decor just because our house is in construction right now. We're renovating the floors and the entire kitchen. So I honestly don't know what we'll be doing for Easter, but I know for sure I'm gonna be making them an Easter basket filled with all these goodies. But I bet Natalie got some house stuff, so definitely check out her channel. Tell her I sent you, cause I absolutely adore Natalie. And if you enjoyed my video, please subscribe, please give my video a thumbs up, and I'll see you guys next time, bye!